welcome back to the channel. I'm in red today, so you guys know what it is. It is Chinese New Year. When I think of Chinese New Year, I think of having hairstyles that are romantic and sweet enough to kind of match my flowery dresses, my cheong sums, and of course having them stay in place throughout like all of the visitings and stuff. Because when it comes to Chinese New Year, I don't know about you guys, but my family will visit like five or six places in one day. So that is crazy, and I really need my hair to stay in place. So without further ado, let's get started. First thing first, I'm gonna prep my hair with the Lucido L Designing Aqua Hair Curling Lotion. So this is something like a heat protector. It helps to kind of make my hair a lot more manageable before I start styling it. So you wanna spray on dry hair. It's kind of like a primer and prep for your hair. And since we're gonna be using heat later on, it's good to have like a layer of protection so that you don't damage your hair. It smells so nice. So now that our hair is prepped, the first hairstyle we're gonna be doing is something very simple and I believe everyone would want to know how to do it, which is to create big loose curls because you can't go wrong with big loose curls. You can wear it for your everyday, for work, for prom, for Chinese New Year. So let's go and create that big loose curls. So, I have my Dyson Airwrap here. I usually like to keep it like to the highest settings, so both sides. And you want to repeat your entire head with this. If you don't have a Dyson Airwrap, you can also use a hair colour. It's just, you know, up to you guys based on what you have and what you're comfortable with. So, what I like to do is, I just take random strands and I'll start curling them. So I'm going to curl the rest of my head and I'll be back. Now that I'm back from curling my hair, what I did was I just kind of curled my hair outwards. So imagine this is your hair colour and you want to just frame your face outwards and that way you'll have that very very blow out nice kind of effect. And now that our hair is nicely curled, I'm going to be taking my Lucido L Hair Wax. This one is in the curl variant. It's in a very beautiful lavender shade. And I like to use hair wax especially on special occasions because I just want my hairstyle to last all day and you really need it to last all day especially during Chinese New Year, right? So I'm just taking a pea-sized amount and spreading it in the palms of my hands like this. And what you want to do is you want to warm it all up. Make sure it becomes transparent and just have a little bit on your fingertips and run it through your hair and do this scrunching motion. So I really love using this hair wax, especially on days like this because it makes my hair so much more manageable and at the same time, it doesn't make my curls look too like crunchy. You can see the definition of the curls a lot better and by scrunching it up like this, especially at the roots, you'll be giving it a lot more volume. Ta-da! It's super simple, right? Okay, so for the first hairstyle, I want to keep it side swept. So it's important to just make sure that there's no flyaways and this is where the wax will come in really handy. Twist it and put it to the side. So volume at the top and a clean side swept. This hairstyle will be really really good for people who have like you know a little bit of neckline, you want to show a little bit of your shoulders. It will be really nice and romantic. It's a super simple hairstyle but this is just hairstyle number one. And yeah. So before we go, we always have to keep and lock everything in place. I love the Lucido L Designing Air Hair Spray. I use this for years. I love it because it really just helps to keep my curls and whatever style I have in place without making it too sticky or crunchy looking. So it still leaves it very, very natural. So just spray a little bit. And you're good to go. Okay, so for hairstyle number two, we are gonna be doing a messy updo. So this hairstyle is very, very good for people who are planning to wear a cheong sum or anything with like a little bit more details all the way up to the neck and you don't want to let your hair hide your neck. But instead, you want your hair to kind of complement your entire look. So for this, I'm gonna part my hair in the center. Just a very 
simple center parting will do. And what you want to do is, you want to take a hair wax. This one is the Lucido Hair Wax Volume. It comes in a hot pink packaging like this. And same thing, what you want to do is just take a pea-sized amount, put it in the palms of your hands, and make sure you warm up the product before you apply it into your hair. And this one really helps to create a very nice and tasseled uh, texture. So what I'm doing is I'm just kind of scrunching up the pieces that are framing my face because um, it will make it so much easier to work with later on. Okay, and I want to build the volume inside as well. Then, gather all the hair in a low ponytail like this. And you want to just do a very, very loose and messy bun. Twist it. Like so. And you want to take a rubber band. Tie it up. Okay. Then, because we already applied like hair wax, right? You know, you can start pulling out loose strands without a lot of chunks coming out. So you want to start from the crown, just pull. And what you want to do is you want to pull out pieces to frame your face as well at the front. So because we already applied the volume hair wax, you can see that there's a lot of volume going on, um, but at the same time, it doesn't like stick out, you know, it doesn't fall out because you already have a little bit of hair wax to hold it all in place. If you want anything, you can always just use a bobby pin and just pin it all in place. So there we have it. This is the second hairstyle. It's super simple to do. It's very effortless. And what you have to do is just put on a big nice earrings and it will really just complement the entire look. Before you go, you also must remember to always hairspray your hair. So just juice a little bit. Alright, and now we're down to our last hairstyle. This one is a very romantic half up, half down kind of updo. So this is for those of you who want to kind of just still keep a little bit of your hair down uh, but you know, you don't want to hide too much of your neck. This is a very, very good hairstyle for you. So for this, I'm gonna be using my Lucido L Hair Wax in the Variant Arrange Fix. This one comes in a very beautiful baby pink top like this. And this one has a much more light consistency. So what I'm gonna do is I'm also gonna take a little bit and just put it in the palm of my hands. Same thing, you wanna make sure that it's all transparent before you start working it in. And for this hairstyle, this wax is really, really good to kind of tame the flyaways and it's very, very good for braids, holding braids and curls and just in general, hairstyles that require a little bit more manageability. I'm just applying it at the pieces that frame my face because this is what I'm gonna work with. What you wanna do is you wanna just take about this amount and you want to start braiding it. So because our hands have like the um, arranged hair wax earlier, it makes braiding so much more easy and the flyaways also don't come out that much. Just secure it with a rubber band. And same thing for the other side. What you want to do is you want to take these two braids that you just did, cross it behind and use a hair tie to just secure it. Alright, so now you want to just use your fingers and lightly tap onto the braids to make sure you kind of fatten it and make it more voluminous. Same thing goes for the fringe area and you can always just pull out a little bit of fringe around the sides of your face to just frame it up a little bit more. And 
this is hairstyle number three. It's super simple. It's very romantic. It took me less than like five minutes to create, really. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. And if you did, don't forget to check out the description box below. Um, I'll try my best to link everything in the description box for you guys. And if you guys really enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe, like and share, join the fan, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Happy New Year!